There is a great distance between the heavens above and the earth below. Or is there? When the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Natural Resources Conservation Service sought a spokesperson for their Healthy Soils campaign, they thought of Dr. Laura Danley, curator of the Griffith Observatory in Los Angeles. Studying Earth is just like studying the planets. Earth is a planet, and it's the most amazing planet we know. It's the only one we know that has life on it. So it's a natural for me to want to talk about Earth and share some important messages with people about how we can make Earth healthier. What if I told you a secret that might just help us meet those challenges? And what if I told you the secret lies not in the stars, but in the soil? This new web video promotes practices that farmers can use to protect and enhance their soils. Techniques such as conservation tillage, crop rotation, and cover crops can help build up organic matter in soils. Microbes are amazing, packaged in that little tiny space. All the functions of life, ingestion and digestion of energy, growth, it's the same processes going on inside of microbes that are going on inside of us. Promoting microbial activity in soil can lead to better crops, less erosion and chemical use, and higher profits. Soil health is going to give you higher yields, period. And if we don't protect these few inches of topsoil we got left, um, that's it. We're done. Dr. Danley says soils and science are a perfect fit. Everything on Earth came from out there. Earth pulled all of those ingredients that are throughout the cosmos together in one place and in such a way that the chemistry for life was possible. So when we study the way in which plants and soils and microbes work together, we're really just studying another aspect of the universe. Long live the soil. Long live planet Earth. In Los Angeles, California, for the U.S. Department of Agriculture, I'm Pat O'Leary.